There are a few courageous Hollywood celebrities out there who are willing to take a stand on the front line against the woke mob that continues to try to destroy everything in their path. And actor, comedian Marlon Wayans is the most recent actor to take a stand against the nonsense that we are all continuing to have to deal with here in our culture. And man, does he rip the woke mob a new one in this incredible interview. So let's get into this and see what he has to say. An interview with BuzzFeed, Wayans. Uh, defended the com comedy uh, White Chicks, a movie about two black FBI agents that go undercover as two white women. When asked by BuzzFeed whether he thought that a movie like White Chicks could thrive in today's political climate, we all know where BuzzFeed stands on this, uh, Wyans responded, I think they're needed. I don't think what, I don't know what planet we're on where you think people don't need laughter and that people need to be censored and cancelled, he said. If a joke is gonna get me cancelled, thank you for doing me the favor. And unfortunately, a lot of this that is happening right now with cancel culture it does stem from a fasci fascist um, Marxist type of mentalities where you must continue to censor everyone until you get the exact narrative that you want from people, which is exactly what a lot of this is stemming from. So Wyan said that he has no intention of listening to those who are afraid of how the woke mob might respond online. Y'all do what you want to do? Great, he said. I'm still going to tell my jokes the way that I tell them. And that is exactly the mentality that I think a lot of us have here who watch my channel and everything else. You know, we all agree that people should be able, able to express themselves how they want. A lot of the woke insanity out there, I'm not calling for those people to be censored or silenced or anything else. I'm not calling for those people to be canceled or to be banned from social media or anything else, despite the fact that I think a lot of their ideas are ridiculous and insane. But yeah, I'm going to call them out for it. I'm going to call them out and criticize their their opinions and their viewpoints on different things. But I'm not calling for them to be silenced. There is a huge difference between what the left is doing and what common sense individuals like me and you are doing where we see the insanity. We're calling it out, but we're not calling for those people to be censored, canceled, whatever else. Which we can't say the same for the left and the way that they are handling people that have opinions that they don't like. And if you want to make some money, jump on board. And if not, then I'll take, then I'll find a way to do it myself. I know my audience. My audience comes to my shows every weekend and they f leave feeling great and laughing. One thing about the Wyans, we've never, we've always told the worst jokes the best way. The New York Post noted that just last year, Wyans said that it was time to make a sequel to White Chicks. I think White Chicks 2 is necessary, Wyans told Variety in an interview. I think we've tightened up so much that we need to loosen our ties a bit and laugh a little bit, which is interesting because comedy as a genre used to be uh the most like ballsy genre out there it was the genre where you could pretty much get away with with whatever and you can always kind of make fun at the the right people and everything else but comedy has become one of the most least popular genres out there and it continues to do horribly in the box office especially over the past couple of years because of a lot of the woke insanity that is happening and the way that woke insanity has affected and infiltrated even genres like comedy so with that being said let me know what you think about what marlon wayan says here in this interview i think that he is absolutely spot on and i think that he is correct about what he's saying hope you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe and i'll talk to you all in another video very soon